Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I want to welcome you. And if you've been here for a while, thanks for your continued support. In today's video, I will be sharing another Tea Time vlog. This time, the location is Warwick, New York. I will be sharing all the information you need to know if you plan to visit this lovely place for a nice cup of tea. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and don't forget to like and comment. Warwick, New York is an enchanting little town filled with nice and cozy boutiques and shops. One of the gems in this town is called Charlotte's Tea Room. Charlotte's Tea Room is located in a beautifully renovated Victorian home in the historic Hudson Valley, and they offer a variety of food items including a traditional afternoon tea menu. The aesthetic of this place is so warm and inviting. They have three indoor seating areas, which include a lovely garden room filled with vintage glass top tables and shelves that are filled with these beautiful teacups and saucers. This room will make you feel like you're in a lovely garden, even on a cold winter day. The next seating area is called the Blue Willow Room. It features eclectic and beautiful blue china from a 1980 English engraver. The last indoor seating room is called the library. It's a warm and cozy library featuring a fireplace and shelves full of books and tea tins. The tea tins contain the teas that are served in the menu and they are sold to customers. They also had shelves with teacups, teapots, and a beautiful vintage typewriter. My friend and I were seated in the library and we selected the Queen's Tea Menu. The Queen's Tea is $28 per person and it includes one tea sandwich, a soup or salad, a scone, one dessert, and a pot of tea. Now, every tea room is different and this place had some pros and cons to the menu. Let's start with the pros. My friend and I loved their teas. They have a big selection of teas to try, and we had the Paris tea and the wedding tea, which were both very delicious. The scones were very yummy as well, but one of the cons for me was the fact that you had to pay an additional $5 for clotted cream. Most places include the cream and the jam with your order. Another con for me was the fact that you got six pieces of the same sandwich. My friend and I both ordered cucumber sandwiches and we both got six larger pieces. In the end, it was just too much of the same type of sandwich. I prefer it when you have a nice variety of sandwiches, which tends to be the case with most tea rooms. The soup was incredibly delicious though, and we both enjoyed it very much. It was the perfect size and full of flavor. For dessert, my friend and I ordered different desserts and then we just shared since you also get just the one larger dessert rather than a few small desserts. My preference is always variety, but if you don't mind picking one dessert that you know you'll love versus several mini desserts that you're not sure you'll like, then this would be a good option for you. I ordered the pineapple upside down cake and my friend ordered a brownie with vanilla ice cream. Overall, the experience was nice. Their service was great and we enjoyed our tea time. After we had tea, we headed to the shops around the area and found some cute tea related items and an adorable plant shop amongst other very nice boutique stores with unique gift items. I hope that you guys will visit if you're in the area and definitely check out Charlotte's Tea Room as well as take a stroll in the lovely downtown area. Well, that's it for today's video. Thanks so much for watching and have a terrific day. Bye.